beauties welcome back to my beauties big sister channel how is everyone doing i am back from my friend's wedding in spain looking a little bit browner which i'm really happy about um it was such an amazing amazing day can't wait to share all the pictures and the videos with you but i've been to a lot of exciting events recently like weddings and um, the races things like that where you need occasion dresses so i've got a lot of new dresses in my collection right now that i really want to share with you guys and so I thought I'd film an occasion dress haul. So the first dress I wanted to show you is actually in the wash so I'm going to put a picture of it right here and this is the dress that I've just worn to my friend Holly's wedding but as I said we're not allowed to share pictures or videos um, until about two weeks time so I thought I'd just show you a picture of the dress that I did wear and pictures and videos will be on my Instagram soon but this dress is from Miss Selfridge and I loved wearing it it's such a beautiful shade of mint green that looks really nice if you've got a tan very very comfortable to wear and also if you are going somewhere that's going to be really hot it's quite a cool dress the material isn't too thick and it's a nice short dress with a slit up the leg as well the other wedding i went to of course was my brother's and this is the dress that i wore I can't tell you how much I love this dress. I felt so nice wearing it. This is from Destiny and the detail on this dress is absolutely beautiful. So it's a light pastel blue, like a sky blue. And you've got mesh in the middle right here that goes down into a, a plunge. Then you've got all the crystals going around underneath the bust and it goes all the way around to the back. The back is like... One of my favourite parts of this dress, it's so beautiful. You can see the embellishment here, it's just so much detail has got into this dress and I think it's so nice that it's completely sheer at the back with all of these beautiful crystals. It just shined in the sunlight and also in the evening for the dance floor bit it really did shine underneath the light it's quite a heavy dress but i didn't feel too hot in it it's quite a cool fabric and it's really nice and flowy now this is really expensive it's a very expensive dress but as it was my brother's wedding i went all out and i wanted to feel really nice on that day so that's why i just fell in love with this dress and i knew i had to have it when it arrived it was super super long like crazy long and bearing in mind I'm like five foot eight I think so it was so long for me I couldn't even walk with it so I did have to have it altered I had actually four inches taken off the bottom so it's quite a lot of fabric so if you are really tall then this dress is perfect and I'm sure all of the destiny dresses run like that as well but as much as I completely and utterly love this dress I don't think I will wear it again just because I don't know an occasion that I would wear this to again and I kind of want this dress to remind me of my brother's wedding so I think I will pop this on Depop. I really really need to set up an account so as soon as that's up I will let you guys know if you are interested in buying this dress off of me. Um, I did get the size A and it's just the most stunning beautiful dress ever. This is a dress that I bought as a backup for my friend Holly's wedding. But I think I do just need to keep it because it is such a pretty dress. So this is from Lavish Alice. It's called the Draped Frill Midi Dress. And it's kind of like a scuba type fabric. It's really nice. It's kind of foamy, if that makes sense. And the colour is really, really pretty. So it's this kind of like pinky purple shade. It's super low cut, so you do need to wear maybe like a stick-on bra with this if you don't want to go bra free. And then you've just got the most incredible frill detailing going down the length of the dress, which I absolutely love. It's different, it's pretty, it's dressy. I really feel like this will make a statement. And again, I feel like the colour goes really nice when you've got a summer tan. So I definitely want to keep this one because... Even though it's quite a simple dress, with the frill, it just makes it something special. And then I really like how the straps are different as well. So on this side, you've just got a spaghetti strap, whereas this side, it's a thicker one. So it's just a kind of detailing on this that really made me fall in love with it. This might just be my favourite dress in this whole entire haul. If you love, like, a 
princess kind of dress this is the one you need to get so this is from Chi Chi and if you haven't been on the Chi Chi website please go and check it out because their dresses are so beautiful if you've got a prom or you're going to the races or if you're going to a wedding they just have the most amazing dresses and for really good value as well so this one is like a peachy pink it's got that ribbon around the waistband and then I absolutely I'm obsessed with the floral pattern at the bottom I'm not big on florals I don't normally wear floral prints but this is so subtle it's really gorgeous pastel colors and it just fades into the bottom of the dress so it is really subtle pretty delicate dress the fabric is quite thick but where it's so puffy you're gonna get air going through this dress so it's not gonna be too hot there isn't any netting or anything like that in the dress if I did wear this I would definitely wear it with my hair up just to really accentuate the shape of the dress this is called the Rihanna dress from Chi Chi it's a mink color so kind of like a, a dusky rose it's a bardo so I really really love bardo styles as you can tell a lot of my dresses are actually bardo that I wear so this is off the shoulder and it comes shorter at the front and then drapes down really long at the back which just feels so nice when you're wearing it it feels very princess like you feel very dressy it's got some very subtle embroidery detail running through the front of the dress I feel like this would be quite a hot dress so if you're going somewhere that maybe is going to be aircon then I think this would be a really good dress to wear but if you are going to be out in the full sunlight this could be quite a hot dress to wear it feels so special when you're walking and it's just like floating in the air now this dress is from ASOS and when I got it out of the packet I wasn't sold on it I didn't instantly fall in love with it but as soon as I put this on I just thought of all of the Dolce and Gabbana vibes this print is so Dolce & Gabbana it's a really cool cut actually because you've got these kind of panels here and it just really drapes out it's quite a, a puffy dress but again it's that scuba foamy kind of material so it is quite lightweight so the base of the dress is lemon and then you've got all of these different colors which again it probably wouldn't normally be me going for all these florals but actually once it's on it just looks so cool it's so modern so on trend now this is the dress that I wore to the BAFTA TV nominee party and this is from House of CB it's their very classic super tight super stretchy bandage material so if you don't like clean clean things then this won't be for you but if you do really like that sucked in silhouette kind of look this is one incredible dress I really loved wearing this and I was very undecided between two of the shades there was this peach one or the lilac -y one but once I tried them on I think the peach one is definitely more me you've got this frill that goes over the bust area here and then it's just a very simple bandage dress that goes down with your bandage kind of stripes going through the length of the dress horizontally a slight slit at the back but as I said this is a very tight dress so it's quite hard to walk in you can't really stretch your legs that far but it's kind of handy you've got a bit of a slit at the back here which makes it a little bit easier to walk again House of CB is just a brand and website that I love I feel like you can't go wrong with their dresses they are slightly expensive dresses but I feel like you're really paying for the quality here and you know that you're going to get a really good quality dress for the money you're spending and this is the dress that I wore to Epsom races and this is from quiz now I was really really surprised at the quality of this dress because I wouldn't have normally thought of going to quiz for an occasion dress but this is so beautiful so it's a white lace it's more like a crochet kind of dress it's quite padded you've got cups in here so you don't really need to wear a bra if you don't want to I did find this come up slightly bigger than my normal size 8 dresses so I probably would have been better in a size 6 if that helps you guys the shape of this dress is really really nice so it kind of comes in at the waistband here and then really floats out it's not like a, a real puffy dress it's just a very very delicate kind of floaty dress the lining of the dress is nude but then at the bottom it kind of stops a bit shorter so you've got the white lace just against your skin tone here at the bottom floating 
out. I felt really comfortable in this dress. I loved it and I think it is a very, very good value dress. You guys seem to love this on Instagram. I got so many comments and messages about this one. So obviously all the links will be below if you do want to check out any of these dresses. But I will also link even more dresses that I found that I love online as well. So you can have a real shopping haul. I really hope you enjoyed watching this haul. Please do let me know in the comments below if you did and what your favourite dress was. If you are going to be getting one of the dresses then please let me know and tag me in your pictures. If you haven't subscribed already then please please do. The button will be below and just make sure you click on the bell so that you are notified when I do upload a video. I really hope you're having a good week and I will see you in my next video. Bye beauties!